This is the Double Dancer, and I want to welcome you back to Mind Fantasy 2 2.8 Tutorial Let's Play. Alright, and we have made our bronze hammer and bronze anvil so that we will be able to make our bronze tools. So let's get this lined up. We will throw in that get it lit and let that cook while we come in and sleep the night away just as soon as we're able to there we go all right so as you can see i just went right on into the second episode we'll go ahead and check this and our in our bronze is made. So let's go ahead and throw these in. Grab them. Perfect. Okay, that's six, seven, eight, and one more is going to be nine. There we go, and if we look, it's empty. Um, what we do need to do, real quick, is chop that up, grab it, and come over here. And we'll fill it back up with water, come over and place it down. So there ain't no sense of wasting time making a bucket when it's that easy. Okay, so let's take a look at what we need for our tools again. We need three for the pick. Three for the axe, so that's six. And one for the shovel, that's seven. Two for the hole, hoe. So that will give us nine. We already have a pair of copper shears. Those will work perfectly fine for now. Uh, I did show you how to make them. That is just basically the same for no matter what metal. It just changes with the anvil and the hammer levels. Or the tears. So, yeah, let's go ahead and get this set up. We'll make sure that we have. Let's see, that would be the pick, the axe, the shovel, and we're missing the hoe. So let's go in and again, we'll just put one piece of leather in, throw our shears down here, and make us some leather strips. Leather strips come in handy because that will come in handy for the armor. And we will start with leather armor and work our way up so I can show you how to make each of the armors. I, Something I really haven't done, I've kind of skipped around in the armors a lot. Um, we'll definitely make the armors from the leather on up through padded and everything. And go into actually making the different, meta, different uh, metal armors as well. I would like to wait until we can make the iron versions. They are a lot stronger than the bronze. And I'm sure that we should be able to get away with just working with the leather for now. All right, so let's get this going here. Did say we needed nine, I believe. If not, you got one extra. Easy enough. Come on, light up. There we go. 
so let's get our wood in here. There we go, that's all going to be off of that. All the handles are the same. So let's grab the bronze, put it in here. Okay, first things first, bronze pickaxe. It is going to take the bronze hammer. So we start working it, try to keep it in basically what looks like the parenthesis. Wow. Yeah, parenthesis, let's think of quotes. Okay, so got that made, we pull the pick out. And there's our bronze pick. As you can see, it did take a little damage. It's just something that happens. And the bronze will be a tier one tool. It doesn't say it, not sure why, but it is tier one. So let's move that over and we'll make our bronze axe. And try to keep it in the center. Pull it out and pull it off. That took damage too. Okay, maybe I'm going to need to make a uh, better trough. I'll show you how to do that. So let's go in here. Here's our bronze hoe. Probably get away with a smaller one, like tin or even copper, but bronze has more durability. And it's not going to hurt anything. It's giving me experience towards every, towards it, either way. But I do get a little more experience towards my artisanry by making the bronze to make yo dragon what up oh you're what's up oh good lord do you see those flames he does not like me All right, well, we were lucky enough when we were over on the mountain doing our stream that he didn't show up. However, he did come to visit us this time. Um, yeah, we're going to armor ourselves up and go after him. Because uh, we want his heart. Let's see. Forged weapons, what are we going to use? Uh, a dagger? No. A sword? No. No. A war axe? No. A tin mace? No. We are going to use a spear. And the different woods give you different tiers. Bronze is a tier one, so I'm just going to use a tier one wood. But as you can see, it does use a lot of uh, wood, timber, and leather strips. Okay, and it does look like he's gone. That's the cheap way of doing it. There we go. Wow. Looks like my shovel didn't take damage. That's the only thing that didn't. All right, so we have those. I need a pair of tongs. Got my hammer. And it's just going to take two bronze to make the tongs. So I should have thrown, thrown them in. When I uh, did the other, I completely forgot about the tongs. Thought I actually had them. 
There we go. And the sad part is, I gotta make a pair of stone tongs to cover up my mistake. And there's the stone tongs. Hopefully it doesn't overheat the metal. Um, workable, there we go. And tongs. There we go, grab them, and drop them in. So what we will do We have a full set of those. Let's come in here. We'll go ahead and make another strip. some more bronze and then we'll make us a bronze spear. So I have plenty of oak. So if you're gonna make bronze, you know you're gonna use a lot of it. Might as well just set it up to cook a full batch. go. How am I doing on my levels? Ooh, water scenery seven. Look at this. That's good. Actually, seven and a half. Uh, water scenery ten. I'll be able to study the repair kit as well as the iron. Once I'm able to study my iron and unlock it, that's when I can make my iron tools. But in the meantime, everything I am doing is doing good. All right, the bronze is ready. So you can come here, drop those. Oh, that got switched. Okay. That's six. And okay, so we were making a bronze spear, just like this, and then three bronze there. So we come over and we put in three bronze. coal, light it up, come on, light up, there we go, get that lit up, we are workable, okay, so let's make our bronze spear. took damage. Okay, so 5.5 .5 attack damage, and that is a 4 attack damage. So you can see that it's increased. That is why you upgrade your, your uh, weapons. So let's go ahead and move all this back in. can 
go there, there. And I can go up there. Don't need that down there. Um, one of the items that we do need to make that we'll be storing inside is going to be on the basic tab. It is the sewage station. Now we need any timber, crafting bench, flint, and two stone. So, I happen to have a crafting bench, two timber, two stone, and a flint. The rest of this can go back in. Right, so this is done through the carpentry bench with a hammer that I put away. Okay, so let's go ahead and set this up. That goes there, that goes there. And we know those are there and those are there. Basic salvage bench. Station. Yeah, name changes. All right, so let's go ahead, make it, pull it out, and we'll put our hammer away. We'll come right back here and we'll actually put it there. That was kind of harsh sounding. Now to use this use it on anything that you have no more use for. A stone anvil. Don't need it. Throw it up there and right click it. You have a chance to get everything back or nothing. Or from everything to nothing. So I got one stone back. I know, you're saying, but devil. That's just one stone. Well, if you happen to need four, all right, look, I got three, now I have four. Otherwise, I'd just be throwing it away and letting it despawn or throwing it in lava, and I wouldn't have anything. And then again, sometimes you just can't throw. There we go. And see here, I got a stick and a shark or stone. So that's pretty good. And all you do is just throw it on, right click it. And see this one, I didn't get anything. It was damaged pretty badly, I will say that. So let's try that. Okay, that didn't give me anything. And the stone spear gave me a stick. All in all, I got two sticks and a sharp stick or sharp rock that I wouldn't have had before. I'm not going to complain. Uh, I don't need the hoe. Uh, carry the axe on me. All right, so let's see. We did the bronze. We did a bronze weapon. We did bronze of those or bronze tools. I was going to make a bronze knife. and an upgraded version of our bench. So, what do we need for the bronze knife? Let's 
Let's go back to basic. Let's go into crafting tools. Here's the knife for a knife. Be it whatever. Um, we're going to need one ingot. One and one. So it's one timber and one leather with one ingot. And ingots have to be hot, of course. So let's grab the bronze. Let's grab that. Let's grab that. I need my tools back. Because I forgot and didn't think ahead. You know, standard. Now what we will do while we're waiting is we're going to need nails. And double check the nails. We're going to need some other stuff. What we're going to make is I think we got to come back around to basics. We are going to make this one, the tanning rack, not the shabby. We're going to need refined wood, which comes out to be a tier two wood, but that's fine. Now to make the refined wood, we are going to need to come down to construction and refine planks. Those are nail planks. Those are refined planks. Okay, here's the refined timber. You need plant oil and any timber. To get the plant oil, you need four empty jugs and a seed. And this is what you need to make the jug. You need for clay and make four jugs. So let's get those started. So it's this pattern. Yeah, we'll throw those in to cook. It is dark. We'll sleep. There's our one seed that we need. We do need to plant a garden soon. But I'll take all the bronze because we do need to make more stuff. I want to make a bronze needle as well as the bronze knife. So let's take these. And this is made in the basic workbench. Well, shapeless crafting is what it's also called. So there is four and one. Okay. Now to make the timber into refined timber, we need to come in here and put it like that. We need our bare hands because I guess we're rubbing it in. As you can see, 
that gives us four empty containers for timber. Now we still need four, so we do need another seed. I should have cooked eight, but that's okay. I'll cook later. It's no biggie. Um, put that in there. It's more refined. And to do this, we put those three up there. Take our refined, give us our box. And that's our regular tanning rack. We just come over to the hammer. As you can see, even slowly hitting, it takes a while. And we are at our 25 minute mark. So what I will do is I will call the episode here right after I break this up and get the new tanning rack down. That pretty. All right, so next episode, we will get rid of the tanning rack. And we will make our uh, bronze needle and our bronze knife. And we will see what else we uh, have available. Maybe we will uh, start our leather armor. Yes, next episode we will do that and start our leather armor. So. I do want to thank you for coming and, uh, and staying with me during the episode. I hope you did learn something. And I will talk to you all later. Have a good day.